I so I come from a, a physics background, and and it really is for me. It was it was sort of those problems seemed too easy, too simple, um, and and too sort of well defined. And coming over to psychology, um, it was really nice to have you know these problems like language and and sort of how we think and how we how we feel. Um, that were just so rich and so deep and such such interesting problems and such the you know, ones that we sort of interact with on a daily daily basis. I think a lot of people sort of take it for granted. Uh, we tend to have this sort of like, oh well, I have a brain, so I, I know something about how they work, and and it's it's really you know, or I use language, I know something about how language works, and it's it's they're just such complex phenomena. They're so rich and so powerful that. Um, I think a lot of people take it for granted how, how difficult it is to study them uh, and study them properly. I think, I think the best way to sort of address it is, is through awareness and through um, just talking about it more and making people more aware that, it's, that it is out there, it is part of life, it's not, you know, it's not, their, it's not someone's fault if they, if they have issues. With, we all have issues, some sort of issues with mental health and, and sort of acknowledging that and, 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 uh, and, and trying to destigmatize it as much as possible. Is, is really the only way forward.